Dude, I don't like how cold it is. It's so cold, my, um... My freaking hands, dude. I keep complaining that my hands are cold, but, like, they're freaking cold. I want to wait a little bit, see if Fami gets in here. Let me practice, uh, Miko. Or, wait. What's, what's something that, what's something that kills me? Sega! Sega's been messing with me. Let me, let me look at Sega real quick. Just to make sure she doesn't fuck me. You know what I mean? <laughs> and then we'll, and then we'll jump in. I kind of wish that I could look at the overdrive spells. You know what I mean? Hooray! Yes, Femi, you made it! Uh-oh. How many, how many attempts do you think it'll take for me to get this? Ow. Probably one game over, maybe two. Game over? You're expecting me to game over? I don't think I'm gonna game over. I'm... I might I might screw up my... My bombs. But I don't, I don't think a game over is gonna happen. I hope this, uh, this Sanai parallel ending is juicy. I hope it's a good one. I hope it's entertaining. Oh, Fami, also, after I get this run, I'm gonna go back to, uh, Perfect Cherry Blossom. Put socks on my hands. Man, that's a... Yeah, that's a... That's a good idea. Yeah, then, then how am I... How, how do I play? <laughs> I do have some fingerless gloves. But then my finger's gonna be cold. Sit back, enjoy, because we're going to have a very relax- Oh god. We're gonna have a relaxing time. Because after I get the- We're going for the parallel ending, uh, with Sanai. In Ten Desires. And then once we get the parallel ending, assuming it doesn't take all day, um, I'm going to be returning to Perfect Cherry Blossom to get my- to, uh, unlock the extra stage so that I can, uh, so that I can fight Ran. But that means I'm gonna go for the 1cc. I could use the unlock code like I did for Mountain of Faith, but I kind of want to, to have my runs. I'm also planning on doing Mountain of Faith again anyway, so. We are gonna be doing it on normal, and it's been a long time, so, uh, you know, it'll be fun. I don't have any reason to expect my, me to, myself to get this first try, but we could be optimistic. I'm, I'm excited to go back to uh, Perfect Cherry Blossom, because I remember, like, it's not one of my favorites. Well, I, I guess I, that's, nah, that's, that's a lie. Perfect Cherry Blossom is one of my favorites, honestly. It's not as good as Imperishable Night or Subterranean Animism, but it's a pretty good game. Wh who was your favorite Toho? character. Seija? Seija's the, uh, the backwards girl, right? I, I also don't know what game she appears in. Yeah, she- yeah, okay, she's the backwards girl. What game is- she, well, I guess it'll- it'll be more fun if I don't know what game she is, appears in. Forget I said anything, just don't- what, don't look up- wait, why? Why- oops, DDC- oh! Oh my qu- oh, Seija appears in DDC. Oops. There wasn't really- I forgot that I asked that. Oops. <laughs> oh well. It's not that big of a deal. Oh no, Toho spoilers! The only- the only- the only thing is it's just gonna- I guess it'll take away a bit of the surprise, but... I mean, it wouldn't be the first time. I already know who appears in Legacy of Lunatic Kingdom. I already know Cherno appears in... Four Seasons. Because of Tan Cherno. Ow, I got too close. She wasn't- she wasn't bleeding as many spirits as I wanted her to. I-, I what- what's up with that? She gets double trans? Uh, I- oh, now that you mention it, I do think that is her ability, yeah. I should have looked at that, but yeah, I, I, at the very least, I believe she gets more trans than others. I think that's- that's her special ability. So she gets trans at the same rate you normally get on Hard on Lunatic. Ah! Ow. That did not look like it was gonna hit me. <laughs> at all. I'm surprised it did. That's really surprising. Putting in the work. Kevin has made more clips than anyone else. Besi besides me. 
I'm the only person that has made more clips than him. He 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 takes my worst <laughs> moments and clips them for me. <laughs> Even before I feature them, uh, they somehow managed to get like like ten views. It's crazy. I did see the I did see the EXNN by the uh uh Femi. <laughs> Congratulations, man. Let's stop dying on the first two stages, please. Well, if I die here, it's not really my fault. It's just kind of a fact of life that you just die here sometimes. There we go. Dying on 10 Desires early game is the most normal thing ever. Yeah. If I wanted to, I could just say fuck it to the resources and see if I can't. Like, I mean, like, with Marissa, I was able to... I was able to get the parallel ending with five lives remaining, so I mean, like... Do I need all these resources? Maybe I can just chill at the bottom of the screen and, like, not even bother. And then I wouldn't have to worry about the terrible early game. You know what I mean? Do you guys think I'll be able to beat Perfect Cherry Blossom 1cc first try? Even after, like, a year of not playing it? Depends which difficulty. Hey, welcome, welcome, Bravi Dano. Um, the difficulty will be on normal difficulty. Same difficulty that I did when I 1cc'd it about a year ago. A year or, uh, maybe even two years ago. It's, it's, it's hard for me to remember that far back. Uh, like, I, I, I've been saying, like, like, I started a year ago, but I think it's been closer to, like, two years. Bruh. PCB normal is tough-ish. Why are people saying it's hard? Guys, you can set how many lives you get. You- you can put, give yourself a billion lives and you can use Sakia. Sakia gives you four bombs per life, you can set yourself to, I think, start out with- I don't know how many lives you can start yourself- you can s set your max lives to, like, something ridiculous. Yeah, but a lot of people don't do additional lives. You set lives? I definitely won't be setting lives here, like, when I- when I play. And I didn't know- the, here's the funny thing, right, Kevin? When I played- uh, EOSD, Perfect Cherry Blossom, Imperishable Night. The funny thing about it is, is that you can- you can set your lives in those games, and I never knew that you could. I never knew that you could. I didn't know until after I'd already beaten them. <laughs> but the fact that you can makes it that much easier. Like, if you want to go- if all you care about is the 1cc, like, dude. You know what, Yuko? I'm not- I'm not about to do this today. Let's just- let's just chill. I don't think I need these resources. Oh my god, I'm at 3 power. How often is it that I get to 3 power this early? That's pretty crazy. Uh, I think the- and the, uh, little guys spawn on the right side, so uh, yeah, that's how I want to do this. No, they spawned on the left side this time. Hello? They must spawn on the opposite side to where your character is. What the dog doing? Yes, what is- what the Kyoko doing? <laughs> it's a little scary. Kyoko can- okay. Kyoko, alright, listen. I, I, I don't want to deal with you right now. Like, I don't want you to be sitting on the right side of the screen. Where the bullets are spawning. Or... What in the world? She's like, avoiding me. Thank you. My gosh. Holy crap. What a shout! Wait until you see the shout that I did in that clip Kevin just shared. Shinobuji, welcome! We got a- we got a run going! How's Sanai? Yeah, Sanai's going pretty well. It took us- it took me a while, but we- we finally got something good going. Hopefully it doesn't, uh, go to shit. The shotgun type. Literally, I am literally not even going to be using this to shotgun, like, at all. I need to remember to use the, uh, use trans to kill Kogasa. If- if I fail, I'm gonna use trans to kill Kogasa. Because killing Kogasa with trans will get me more, um... That- that'll get more out of- out of that. But yeah, welcome Shinobuji, I'm glad you could make it. Hopefully this is the one. Hopefully this is the one, and then we'll move on to Perfect Cherry Blossom. And, uh... 
Yeah. I mean, Ten Desires, like I said, I, it's kind of... I mean, it, it was oh, it was good. It's it's fun. It's relaxing. I don't know, it's just not as exciting as other Toho games that I've played. Squid Dog! Welcome! We've got a good run going. Did you see the uh, patch notes for Splatoon? For, for the uh, next season of Splatoon? Oh, I'm so hyped, dude. They're they're changing Salmon Run. They're cha they we're getting nine new weapons. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> I see you're excited though, <laughs> dude. I'm excited too. I know I I'm not really showing it because I'm kind of having a focus, but um, I can't wait, dude. Oh my god! All right, that almost hit me, but luckily it didn't. Let's go! This is a run! Well, a run, not the run, but it's the run, a, a run! <laughs> this is so good. We're gonna get another life, and I don't know if we're gonna get our sixth life, but maybe we won't need it. Hopefully we won't need it. <clears throat> so we're looking at six lives, and then maybe two more bombs. One, two, maybe two more bombs. You would make an excellent hermit. <laughs> All right, Sanai, become a hermit. That's what I want to see. I want you to become a hermit with Yamu. That that's that is the parallel ending I want to see. Either that, or I want Sanai to convince Yomu to become a hermit. That's that's the that's what I want that her parallel ending to be. Which one is your favorite uh, deep cut member for the update? You're talking about the um. Are you talking about for the um? The upcoming Frost Fest, because if you're talking about that, I'm really digging um, Shiver's design. As much as I hate Shiver, she 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 got it good. <laughs> Come to the Taoist side. We have Dookie. What the hell, Fami? Don't follow him. You do not want Dookie. Uh oh. Sanai having outside world drip when. You should have seen her, um, the, uh, regular ending in this game. You missed it. And the regular ending, she, um, she's wearing normal clothes. Who are you that calls upon me here? I'm a god. Did you come here to smite me? Yes. <laughs> I imagine that's how that conversation went. Hmm, this is a really dense pattern. That's not great. Looks like I'm gonna have to go through- I'm gonna have to do the, um... The recycling method, which, uh... As we know is, uh... Very particular. You have to do it a very particular way, and you have to... Be very careful with the way you do it. This is what we're, g we're going in with. And it looks like, I believe we're gonna get another life? Maybe? We might get another life, we might not, I don't know. In more recent translations of Ten Desires, Fudo uses Shakespearean English? Really? Ooh. Ooh, fancy. I like that. Does she speak more old-fashioned um, in Japanese? She speaks really old-time, yes? Okay, cool. How about Miko? Does she speak old-time as well? Or is it just Fudo? Also, Sanai handles this stage a lot better. The stage portion of this a lot better than Marissa, just because of her spread. So I'm I'm actually glad about that. That's 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 a huge relief. Marissa's kind of bad on this. Four and nine. This is a weird combination. Nine plus six does indeed make another life. However, I've learned from my mistakes, and so I'm just not going to... I'm, I'm not going to go for that extra life. I, I think it's too dangerous to go for that extra life because it's going to make it difficult for me to um, use my bomb method. So, here we go. We're just going to focus on the bombs. Put ourselves at 7 out of 8 bombs. Make sure that we die on the last to second to last spell. So that we can refill on our on our three on our three bombs, and then we'll go from there. It's just Fudo for some reason. So weird. It's been a long time since I've read Shakespeare. It's uh, 
it would be it, it, it would be really hard, difficult for me to understand. I'd have to like read it like several times. So it's so useless too. Nobody sp talks like that <laughs> anymore. You can't add you can't add eth to every single noun or or and every verb and call that Elizabethan. That's not how it works. <laughs> but. <laughs> It does get- it does get close, though. <laughs> Blame the online translator I'm using. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. Something else that you have to- oh god. I'm not even- I can't talk- I, I would like to talk about it. Elizabethan English, but... I- I can't. I have to focus. No. Good death bomb. Good- good death bomb. Um... Let's activate the trance now, because I need to. It, the 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 thing about ten desires is also look at how many lives I have. I have five lives. Like lives are not the issue here, right? So like the hardest part about this is literally just setting it up properly. You sound so sad. Yeah, it's like because I c the worst part about it, uh, Squid Dog. It, like you know, in UFO. One of the reasons why, like, like, UFO was so aggravating, or exciting even, and one of the reasons why, like, you guys got a lot of screaming from me as well, was because, like, it, they were exciting games, and they were really hard, and they were really challenging, and there were just a lot of moments where, like, it was really close, you know? But here, it's not close. It's not close. The game is easy. I'm be literally beating the game with five lives. Five lives that I don't even need. More resources than I even need in order to beat the game. Right? Like, the game is like a snore fest. And yet, to get the secret ending... Setting it up is so is is, is it, you have to do something so specific. You make one little mistake after like thirty minutes of playing the game, and then you have to do it all over. You're gonna get better from playing more. So playtime. The thing is, I don't need to get any better, Fami. This is d crushing my soul. Look at how many lives I have. It's not a skill issue. It's it's an I it's a it's an IQ issue. It's literally a baka issue. If I took a moment to think about what was about what was going to happen after I activated trans, like because you do do damage while you're in trans mode. So I'm gonna like there's a possibility that she will die. I should have taken that into consideration. Okay, that's me being stupid, alright? It was not a result of me being bad at the game. It was not a result of a lack of skill. It was a result of me just not thinking. <laughs> I'm not even gonna- I'm not- I'm not even gonna get resources, I'm just gonna lazily play the game.
<laughs> Dude, I really wanted to play uh, Perfect Cherry Blossom. Okay, well, I, I, I need to get power. I can't just, like, ignore power. If I don't get power, then I'm... At least, at least put myself at two power before the boss fight starts. No, I didn't even... Oh my god. I say I'll play low risk, but the, the thing is, is like, the game, the first two stages are so boring that I can't play low risk, because I'll fall asleep. The other thing about it is, is like, nothing about, nothing about these uh, is different. I felt this kind of with, uh, UFO as well. Like in, in, in EOSD and, um, Perfect Cherry Blossom, Imperishable Night, and Subterranean Animism, the stage changed. Like, things about the levels changed when- depending on what character you chose. But here it's the same thing, the only difference is, like... ...your shot. Look at that face. Imagine kicking it. Okay.
<sighs> all right why do all these girls look so underage yet so pretty FBI open up <laughs> Yo, Squid Dog, I know I've kind of- I'm- I think I'm the one that introduced you to Toho. I would advise that you stay away from certain parts of the Toho community. <laughs> it can get a little wild. Okay. Whew! She saved me. <laughs> Kyoko literally saved me from her own attack. That's so funny. Alright, there we go. <sighs> Alright. Almost at- oh my god, dude, I'm so close to full power, it's not even funny. <clears throat> there we go, now I'm at full power. Alright, cool. Fammy, what are you telling Squid Dog to Google? What's going on? What is this? I won't stand for it. I said that it's Kogasa I need to kill with trans, right? I did. It was Kogasa, yeah. I should have killed her sooner. Because uh, the stage, I think the stage moves while you're fighting Kogasa. So I didn't get as much out of that as I could have. But I think that's, uh, ideal. OK. 
Okay, perfect. Thank you, Prats! Thank you! All I need is to... I, I All I need is to not be stupid. That's all I need. I'm literally just sitting here throwing away attempts. Sinai literally doesn't have enough damage to do that. Wow. And I thought I did that pretty well. Shoot, dude. Alright. Fammy, I really want to. I'm really curious as to what the heck you sh you you you. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. What did you What did you introduce Squid Dog to? Oh God. Why am I blaming you? Who 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 did it then? Who else is here? You have no idea what he what did he do? I don't know what he did either. I'm not, I, uh... Wow, I captured it. Look at that. <laughs> Well, Squid Dog, I don't know. I don't know if I want to know because you might type something that I don't want to appear in my in in this. Send it to the Discord. <laughs> that way I can delete it if it's really bad. I also have a mod in my Discord, so he'll he'll delete it if uh, if it's really bad as well. That is if he's awake <laughs> and not being lazy today. Okay, perfect. Yo, I'm gonna get to this uh, next next life pretty soon here. This is pretty good. Yeah, how does he find something, something bad without? without any keywords that just that just proves that the that the toe community itself can is just can be 
really bad. <laughs> Oh, I could have used uh, Trans to for Se Sega, and then I probably would have been able to get another Trans here. I need to test that. Well, I'm about to be done. Hopefully, I don't. I sure as hell don't want to have to do this again. But Perfect. Perfect. All right. Oh boy. <laughs> Squid Dog, you need to understand Toho is a humongous community. It is a giant community. We have basically everything. Li like everything all the good stuff and all the bad stuff everything even the stuff you don't want <laughs> all right That's okay. I wish I could have gotten that those uh that lo bomb piece and life piece, but oh well. I wasn't really prepared to grab those. I need to be thinking more proactively. I can misdirect these things so that I can uh, dodge these arrows easier, but I'm not thinking about that. And that's probably lending me into some bad, into some worse positions. I can't remember how well my Sega fight went last time. Though my resource count here looks a lot better, so I don't know. Like, I don't think my resources were this great last time. I might not even have to do a setup. I might, like, I might not even have to recycle my bombs in order to get the, uh... In order to meet the requirement for the secret ending this time. Which is good, because that means I can't fuck up. <laughs> oh. But sometimes this 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 spell doesn't like to play nice and it can be really gross. So it depends on uh what I got. Ah, looks like I'm going to have to bomb it, which is uh unfortunate. Hopefully I don't have to bomb it twice, but you never know. There we go. Still five bombs, five lives. That's pretty good. That that's pretty dang good, dude. What? What do you mean that's gone because of the new Google update, huh? What browser are you using? Excuse me? What? 
What? What? That sounds really whack. I, I don't care what browser you're using. If they don't have an X at the top right corner, you need to... <laughs> you, you need to get another browser immediately. <laughs> what is this? Alright. We're on stage 5. This is where things kinda actually matter. Oh my god, dude. Bro, this is awful. I mean, I can't get my resources, but it's okay. If I can get to full bombs, that that I want that would be really nice because like I said, then I wouldn't have then I don't have to worry about then I don't have to worry about recycling bombs. And then I wouldn't then I then there's like actually no chance for me to screw up anything. Squid Dog found the insects. <laughs> oh, last time I died to Soga, right? Hopefully this time I don't. Maybe, maybe, maybe we can go for a no-miss clear. That would be the icing on the cake. No-miss clear with Sanai. Probably won't happen, but one can dream, right? Okay. Okay. Whew. All right. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Look at this. Look at that. We're gonna have so many resources. This is the amazing thing. This is it. This is it. Yes, yeah, Squid Dog, can we drop this? <laughs> can we let's change the topic to like this amazing run I have. Look at look at this. We've got another run going. This time I this time I don't I might not even have to recycle my bombs. <laughs> oh. All right. Yeah, I'm I'm probably going to be able to get another bomb and then when we get to Miko, no we instead of having to recycle like it's so funny, because there's this whole way that you can recycle bombs, and it makes it so that you don't have to not fight Miko without bombs. But it's, it's so interesting, because, like, 
the game is, like, if you can, like, I've been messing up so bad that, <laughs> that it's actually gotten to a point where, mm, where I'm basically no miss, no bombing, almost no miss, no bombing the entire game <laughs> to get this one, to get this. Oh, sheesh, dude. All we need is a good Mononobe fight. You know what they say about counting unhatched chickens. I know, I know. Gotta be careful. Don't count your chickens until they've hatched. There we go. Okay. Ugh, oh, it's a good thing I knew that was going to be my death. I'm so glad that I didn't- that I didn't just assume that capturing the spell meant I wouldn't die. Otherwise that would have been a DKO. Or not even a DKO, a death spell capture. All right. Whew. All right, here we go. Two more spells. Let's go. Good RNG. She went to the left. That's good. Oh, man. I shouldn't have hugged the bottom so, so much. But, oh well. Damn. That, su that sucks, because I was really hoping to not have to eat through all these bombs. Because with two bombs, man... Two bombs is not enough for me to... To not want to recycle my bombs. I'm gonna want to recycle them. If I don't get more. I don't know. We'll have to play it by ear. We'll have to see. We'll we'll just have to see. We'll have to see what happens. How how this plays out. Oh. <sighs> yeah. Think about Bob Ross. Think about Bob Ross. Think about Lace and I. All right. Wish me luck. This is the last one. This is the last one. Just use two bombs. I mean, you say that, but I kind of don't want to rely on only using two bombs. However, I've been playing pretty well, but the thing is, is like, my, maybe it's luck. Maybe it's not skill. Maybe my luck will run out. I don't know, dude. Frick. With all these lives, the thing is, is like, every time you die, you, uh, you lose power. So it has like this snowball effect. I'm sure you know about it, so it's not quite so simple. I don't know. We'll have to see. We'll, we'll we will have to see. I'm gonna play by ear. I'm gonna I'm gonna look at all my options. No, I didn't mean to use a bomb. Frick, dude. That was... that was weird. 
that was that was really weird. I don't know. I accidentally used a bomb instead of using trans, which was really unfortunate. And then, I mean, uh, I should have six bombs. If I had six, then I wouldn't... Well, let's see. Let's see. Let's see how this goes. Let's see how it goes. Alright? Let's just see. I oh yeah, I will get the 15-piece life. There's that as well. Okay. Just use the two if I have to. I think maybe maybe that's what I'll do. Two bombs. That would get me through the uh, the first spell, whatever that one's called, and Defiance. Which, those are my two problematic spells. Those are the big ones. Um. Okay. I think I'm ready. Let's do it! Let's get it! Here he goes! We're not gonna use these bombs. We're not gonna recycle. Oh, but these nons are also bad, is the thing. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see, Fammy, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I don't know. We, we're, 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 like I said, we'll play it by ear. Ugh. They were just about to disappear, too. Oh god, I need that- I need that bomb piece. In case I decide to go for recycling, but... Maybe I won't do that. <sighs> Alright. That's one life down. <sighs> I will get another bomb, so that is technically six bombs. Frick, dude. Come on. I'm not doing damage to Miko. This is not good. Come on. Oh god. Oh god. Ah. Oh. We need that extra bomb now. Um, I think I'm just going to recycle. I'm going to go for the recycle. What's this one? Ah, uh, this one. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for the recycle. I'm gonna use a bomb. Just a planned bomb to throw it. Just to whittle down the health. Okay. That puts us at six. This is Goose Cannon. Which, I, okay, I need to use the bomb now so that I can die on the next spell. Oh, okay, there we go. I'm not gonna be near her. 
Run that out, run that out, run that out, run that out. Okay, go, 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 go. Grab the bomb piece. We're good, we're good. This is it. No more bombs. No more bombs. Frick. We have no more bombs. Let's go. This is it, guys. It's now or never. Oh god, this is bad position. I'm also at low power now. Oh! Frick, dude! Come on! I might actually lose this because of Sun Eye's bad damage. Okay, get that bomb. Here we go. Three bombs, two lives. This is it. This is pace. We got it. I believe this is- I be- I think we've got it. I think we've got it. This is it. This is it. Yep. That's it. GG! GG, boys! Let's get it! Let's get it! Let's get it! You will donate five dollars if I die there? Dude. Dude, what's funny is you would be donating $5 and I wouldn't even lose the run because I still had two lives. <laughs> In the last minute, I made the decision. I didn't follow Fami's advice. Sorry, Fami. I, I made In the last minute, I made the decision to recycle my bombs, which is, um, that was a pretty bold last minute decision. Um, I, but... I, uh, I think, I think it was a good decision because I, I don't know. I mean, I still had two lives, but it did save me some power. So, and I was at pretty low power for, um, for the second to last spell. I keep forgetting its name. Time to move on to the next toe game. No, no, no. Next toe game is double dealing character and we're not, we're not quite going to go there yet. We're, we will be going back to Perfect Cherry Blossom. In fact, we're going to go back to it right now. After this ending. After this secret ending. Uh, we'll go back to Perfect Cherry Blossom. See if I can get a 1cc first try. It's been over a year, at least, since I've played it. So, I'm probably going to suck. But, maybe I won't be... Maybe I won't suck. Maybe, maybe it's still all here in the head. Maybe it's like riding a bike. Once you've done it once, you never forget. And you, you, you. <laughs> also, we're gonna be using the 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 easiest shot type. We're gonna use Sakia because I'm gonna do the extra stage with Sakia. Because like, Sakia's goaded. Sakia gets four bombs, so like my chances of losing are like basically zero. I should not say that. <laughs> <laughs> Is this really what Tawa's training is like? <gasps> no! She betrayed the Moria Shrine! Her training and conversion were all for this purpose. However, she soon noticed she wasn't getting any faith herself. Had Sanai taken the wrong path? This is the parallel ending. <laughs> so she left Moria Shrine to become a... <laughs> to become a Shinto? <laughs> Oh, uh, it wasn't quite the the secret ending I wanted to see, but oh, that was so short. I I know in UFO I was like, God dang, these endings last forever. But like, I worked so hard for this. I I I, I worked so hard for this ending, and and this is what I get. This is the ending that I worked so hard for to become toast or Taoist. You didn't hear me say that. She became toast. <laughs> she, 
She to become Taoist, you mean? She's a Shinto shrine maid. Oh, okay. Well, you want to become toast? Yeah. Let's let uh, we. That's a that. I should I should uh. What is the game? I am bread. That that's a fun game we should play. <laughs> you're so glad you're not Taoist, or you would have been actually offended right now, dude. I'm American. I am, I, I, you know, I'm stupid. I'm uneducated to the rest of the world, all right? That's how we are. <laughs> I'm a dumb, ignorant American. That's the, that, that's the way it is. <laughs> all right. Let's go. So... What are my thoughts on this game? I don't know. I So, up until this point, I used to say that the easiest game in the entire series was Perfect Cherry Blossom. But after playing this game, would I change my stance on that? I think I would. Because here's the thing. Perfect Cherry Blossom is only easy if you're using... It's only easy if you're using uh, Sakia. If you use Sakia, Perfect Cherry Blossom is is basically free. You just bomb through everything. You don't have to learn anything. But in this game, like, it doesn't matter what shot type you use. I guess Yomu takes some time to learn. Even Sanai. Sanai was bad, but like... You know... I I was still able to get through just fine. Like it it was so it was so simple. It was so easy. Right? It was th it was no problem. So I just I just kind of felt like you know, this game I think that as far as normal difficulty goes, I think 10 Desires is the easiest. Now that I've played it, and I think that it's even easier than Perfect Cherry Blossom because it doesn't matter what shot type you use. It's easy. For Perfect Cherry Blossom, it's only easy if you use Sakia. Like, I'm going to tell you, like, it can be pretty stressful, especially if, especially when I was just starting out. It was pretty stressful when I was playing as Marissa in Perfect Cherry Blossom. Marissa loses a bomb. <laughs> like, Reimu gets three bombs... Saki gets four bombs, Marissa gets two, and she moves like she's on steroids. She moves like she's Sonic the Hedgehog, and she has a bigger hitbox, I think. Question mark. Correct me if I'm wrong. Like, so if you're using Marissa for Perfect Cherry Blossom, you're going to have a pretty tough time. It's going to be, it's, 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 it's not going to be easy, because you won't have the bomb spam to, to help you. <laughs> It's gonna be a lot more, uh, uh you, you actually have to play the game. Marissa always moves like she's Sonic the Hedgehog. True! PCB Reimu is pretty mediocre, all things considered. I think her homing is pretty me mediocre, but her, um, her, her persuasion needle's alright. It's pretty, it's pretty good. But her homing is, leaves a lot to be desired. Cause like you compare Reimu's homing to Sakia's homing, and it's 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 night and day, dude. I'm not even gonna watch the replay because I I I'm done with that. She, she Jesus, dude. All right, let's go, let's go. All right, give me a moment to set up Perfect Cherry Blossom. Shit. Oh, this spell sucks! This spell sucks, dude! I don't know how you're supposed to do this! I- that's in- that's literally impossible. That is literally an impossible spell. Holy shit. <laughs> no amount of bomb spamming can get you through that. Holy.